Good morning, good afternoon, good evening YouTube, wherever you are, and welcome to Zero Two Hero. Now, I'm recording this on a Sunday night, and the new update for Clash Royale will be going live at some point in the morning on Monday. So, this will be the last time we have the cards in their current forms, with some being nerfed, some being buffed. And I might make a separate video on the next episode, just so I can tell you more about what's happened. But, as you can see here, we have some free chests to open before we play our game, so let us do that. We have a free chest to start with, and we're at 28 gold, some gems, one minion, one archer, and two goblins. Okay, nothing too special, but we'll do the next one. And some gold, two knights, and two arrows. That's okay. And we've got a gold chest here, so I'll open that. Some more gold, one archer, one arrows... Seven bombers. Oh, that's good. We can upgrade that again. And another musketeer. That's lovely. We can upgrade that again. Now we're going to change the deck again because it's good to change the deck every episode. So I think we are going to upgrade the bomber. We can do that. The bomber is now level five, which is very powerful. And I think we will throw the bomber in. Uh, I think we'll throw the bomber in instead of the bomb tower, because the bomb tower is a little weak. And we're going to throw in the musketeer, but we're going to upgrade the musketeer first for 400 gold, which is pretty much all we have, I think. There we go, so musketeer now level 4. We're going to use the musketeer instead of the archers. And I think we're going to put the baby dragon in instead of the fireball so we're going to have no spells but we've got lots of troops so hopefully that should be okay so without further ado we're going to start this chest unlocking and we're going to go into our first battle of the day and last battle of this current update so here we go and as a reminder again i am playing on pc for those who have not watched before because my devices are full with my other accounts so we shall be in Bone Pit versus Nika. Okay. Uh, let's get some. Let's get some baby dragon action going down first. See what happens. Okay. Get the witch down. Hopefully the skeletons will distract. Nope, not quick enough. Never mind. That's okay. We'll get the minions down, and the witch unfortunately got to them first. That's a shame. Never mind. Get the musketeer down to clean up those minions. There we go. So we got an attack coming in two different directions. Our tower's down to 473, but that's not terrible. Okay, so they have a bomb tower themselves. Musketeers should finish that off. There we go. And skeleton army for the goblin barrel. Unfortunately, I didn't quite get the right placement, but we've mostly survived it. And we'll throw a giant down at the back. Oh, the Valkyrie takes care of all those skeletons, which is a shame. And we'll get the baby dragon down, and hopefully the Valkyrie will get pushed away. There we go. Minions there to take out the mini Pekka before it does massive damage to our tower. I mean, now I've got the giant and the baby dragon going in. Bomber down to try and take out as many skeletons as possible. Bomber should take all of those out pretty much. Oh, no. Not too many. Oh well. Here we go. Skeleton army for the knight. Sorry, the prince, not the knight. I always get those two mixed up. I don't know why. There's the minions. We'll get the witch down for the minions. No problem. And we're going to lose our tower here, unfortunately, but that's okay. That's okay. Now, we're going to start throwing massive amounts of things at the opponent there we go goblins doing massive damage to that tower minions and baby dragon doing some good damage I'll throw the giant on the other side to split up his defense musketeer to take out the minions before they kill the giant I'm gonna throw a bomber down to deal with the witch here we go goblin barrel to help support the giant towers will take out the mini pekka skeletons to to uh, cover the prince another giant on this side 
Going to go with the Musketeer as well. We've got 10 seconds. This is going to be really, really close. Come on, Giant. Make it there. Let's get that. There we go. Okay, there goes the Bomber. Taking care of the Goblins. Skeletons to take care of the Prince and the Mini Pekka. There we go. Bomber doing damage. We're now going to throw a Giant in front of everything. We're going to push hard. I'm not too worried there. We're going to get the Witch behind to help take out everything there. Minions to take out the Bomb Tower. We're going to throw a Goblin Barrel at the right tower there just to get some extra damage in. While the tower is distracted with the other troops. And there we go. 2-1. Very hard fought. But we got there in the end. Uh, plus 30 trophies, 7 gold and a silver chest. There we go, up to 694 trophies and we have a crown chest. We'll open that at the end of the episode. So let's go to our second battle. And we're playing against Dieg P. I think maybe that's meant to be Diego. Maybe the typo. Oh, okay. And we have a giant and lots of skeletons. So a bomber and a witch called for. That's fine. Let's see if we can get a giant down in front of everything. Yes, we can. Good. That uh, I misclicked, but minions will do. That's okay. And the baby dragon. Everything takes care of that. Baby dragon going in, tanking for everything. Witch and baby dragon take out the minions with no problem. We're going to throw a goblin barrel down at the back. It's probably an overkill, but... We'll get them down, they can run in. We'll get another bomber down because I think we may be able to take the tower on this push. I think my opponent may have given up. No, he hasn't given up, but I think it's too late. Yeah, two more hits from the witch. There we go, and that's it. Three crown, nice and quick. Okay, well, the misclick there seemed to have actually helped us out. Another 30 trophies. So that puts us up to 724 trophies. I think we shall have one more battle. Let's see if we can get to 750 trophies today. And then we shall open the uh, chest for you. Okay, so we have a level 3 player here. And let's get the witch down to take out these goblins. And we get baby dragon down for the minions, which are very, very weak minions. Our baby dragon should take out their baby dragon. With the help of the witch and my minions. If we can get enough elixir back, we should be able to get the goblin barrel in. There we go. Goblin barrel's going to go in. Mini Peck is going to be distracted by the skeletons. The minions will help take out. And the goblins, the witch, and the baby dragon are now doing massive damage to that tower. And that's the tower down. There we go. We're going to let that, that push go. We're going to put a giant in the back. Okay. Another goblin barrel going down. That's fine. I'll drop a bomber there just to clean up because I don't want to do too much damage. Got the level 1 minions coming in. The bomber's not going to be able to do anything to those, but the tower should clean up nicely. Get a baby dragon down behind the giant. That'll take out their baby dragon. I'll throw some minions down as well just to help out. While well, the giant does some damage to that tower. There we go, everything's down. The Musketeer unfortunately locks onto the Giant so that all of my other troops can get through. We should take this tower down. If the Baby Dragon can stay alive, yes it can. We'll drop a Witch down to take out the Skeleton Army, or the remainder of the Skeleton Army. And the Baby Dragon is now doing work on the tower. We've got Goblins coming in, but the Witch should take them out no problem. We'll drop a Giant down in front. Witch will take out the Minions, absolutely no bother. Gonna throw some goblins behind the king tower, and that should be tower down with the giant and the skeletons pounding on it with the witch. And there we go, another three crown. So that's three games, three wins. Nice and quick today, plus 27 trophies. We should just hit 750, I think. Let's have a look. Yes, 751. So 751 trophies, and we have a crown chest to open, so we'll open that for you. And we have some gold. Oh, an achievement unlocked. Very nice. So we have some gold. We have some gems. We have a mini peck up. We've unlocked the tombstone, so we'll get ready to see that next episode, possibly. We have 11 more goblins. And we have 14 skeletons. Okay. 
that's not a bad haul at all. And we've got the Gatherer for one star, so we'll go and have a look at that. Collect 20 cards. Well, there we go. We'll claim the gems and the uh, 10 XP. Thank you very much. And there you have it. That's games all done today. Three games, three wins, 751 trophies. Two more wins should get us into the next arena. We've got some more chests unlocking. Crown chest ready to go for next episode. And some more free chests when we get to it. I will probably make an extra little video, like I said, to tell everyone about all the changes that have come along in the newest update. Uh, but until then, I will see you in the next episode.